What comes between the pen and the paper? Definitions that can't capture the full meaning. Words confined by lines they walk between, but never cross pens. Gasping for ink, hands grasping for words, brain pumping for activity, suffering a fatal case of writer's block. What comes between the poet and the audience? Mutual stage fright, the curtain calling everyone home, the audience telling the poet what he's saying, the poet telling the audience what they're feeling, the poem taking a bipartisan stance. What comes between two people meeting for the first time, not enough time for small talk, personal bubbles, nobody wants to leave, feeling safe in the wounds we thought we left, greeting strangers with fetal positions, unsure if we're afraid of trusting people or afraid of people trusting us. What comes between two hearts that are breaking, two hands afraid of holding, knowing they'd have to let go of the imperfections they traced on each other's palms, using eyes as windows to the soul, but closing the blinds when there's a salt storm coming, thin lines between love and lost, between closed off and vulnerable between happily ever after and never again. What comes between me and you? Words that won't leap off the tongue, messages that won't send, and promises that couldn't be kept. I've never been good at speaking straight. So I'm gonna stand upright and hope my words follow my posture's example and ditch the shining armor so you can easier find my weak spots. What comes between is the battle between the part of me that wants you gone from my memory and the part of me that built you a home in my dreams and refuses to wake up. It's the empty spots I let you haunt so at least I have something to fill them. It's why my pen runs dry when I try to spell your name. It's the part of human nature I like to call the God that failed comedy. Complex. Ah! Putting as much distance between you and what you can't figure out, what you can't beat, or what you can't forget till it's so far away, it's as distant as a memory. So far behind, but always right behind you. That's the distance I put between you and me. I'm miles away now. I know it's too late to catch the first plane back to the smile I always wanted to build a white picket fence around. But I'm done train hopping. I'm finally staying put, so if you need to find me, you can always find me between the pen and the paper. <laughs>